Hi, I'm Ken. In this Shards of Alara video, we'll be turning the Shard of Esper. The three colors in the Esper Shard are white, blue, and black. Esper is a precisely engineered world where everyone and everything is either made of or infused with a magical metal called Ethereum. The result is that a majority of Esper cards are colored artifacts. Colored artifacts appear in frames that have elements of both artifact cards and colored cards. Besides the frame, you can tell that the card is colored by checking its mana cost, and you can tell that the card is an artifact by checking its type line. The only difference between a colored artifact and a colorless artifact is obviously its color. Unlike most artifacts, a colored artifact requires colored mana to play. Other cards that care about color will interact with them. But that doesn't change the fact that they're still artifacts. It will interact as normal with any card that cares about artifacts. I can destroy it with Smash. You can play Mine Excavation to get it back from your graveyard. Ethereum isn't only found in Esper's inanimate objects. Every Esper creature is an artifact creature. Since their identity as artifacts is the most significant thing about them, a lot of Esper cards care about artifacts. They'll give you bonuses to artifacts, let you search for artifact cards, or check whether you control any other artifacts. These abilities work on all artifacts, both the regular colorless kind and the special colored ones from Esper. Welcome to the machine.